What's going on? Welcome to another video. Now today it is actually my one year anniversary of when I first started the channel like back up. I did start it two years ago, but I only I didn't put that much. I mean, I, I didn't go that hard. I mean, I, I think I only went for like a week or maybe two weeks and then I started up again, I believe last January. But I put so much editing into like these videos, these seven videos that it kind of burned me out and I didn't upload until the uh, next May and it is May 26th today. So I think in order to like kind of celebrate the one year, I think we should kind of look back at older videos and I've looked back at this one because I just want to see kind of like how I was. I didn't look back at my first video or my top five or I mean any of the other sort of uh, videos I did I'm gonna look back at um, just just a few select videos not all of them and we're not gonna watch the whole the whole uh, starting room challenge at a, as it is 13 minutes and we don't want to waste all of our time I'm just gonna kind of skip through it and talk about it and fun stuff like that so let's get right into it guys welcome to a black ops 3 zombies gameplay today we did the starting room challenge on Verizon Jack uh, it really didn't honestly last that long because we sucked and we really didn't have the idea of gobble jumps as you could probably see right now as I'm setting them up. But we, we had fun. It was a nice video. It was an easy video to make, which and I, I just enjoyed making it because I really never done uh, uh, what's it called starting room challenge with anybody. And it was just it was kind of fun. Like even Let's start off with like. I'm super energetic now. I mean, like, when I do my intros, I'm like, what's going on, guys? But, like, this one, it's kind of just... What's going on, guys? Welcome. Oh, and this is actually before I actually I, I chose to go to What's uh, what's Up, Homies. So, back here, I did, um, right here, listen to this intro. What's up, Homies? Welcome to another up. Now, that's a very old. I, that's, I mean, July 20th, 2015. That is three years ago. Um, I mean, two months ago, I mean, or in two months, it'll be three years old, which is insane. And mine was like, what's, what's on or what's up, homie. So I kind of changed it to whatever it is right here. What's going on guys. What's and then guys? I combined it later on to be what's going on, homies to like have my old stuff and my new stuff kind of combined. So that's kind of how I got this and I uh, might as well like it. Why not? And also, I mean, I'm just not energetic. It's just super weird because me, like, as I'm talking right now, I'm, like, getting into it. I have my hands moving and everything. The starting room challenge is basically what, what it's, what is, what is, sounds like. You are only allowed to stay in the spawn room. You are able to use any gobble gums you desire as long as you don't leave the starting room. I hope you guys enjoy. Have a great day. And then link to buy this game just in case you want to buy <laughs> freaking Black Ops 3 by chance. I wasn't even sponsored and I was oh, I was watching this shit dude this is the most unintelligent conversation I've ever heard I love J. Cole but it, it it's terrible uh, I have the background power noise power you can power. literally hear my mom in the background and usually I uh, put a noise gate on it or I actually have an auto noise gate for OBS right now but it's insane how um as I've evolved as a channel it I've kind of learned new stuff with how I edit my videos and how I record them and certain filters I could put on them. So I think it's just really cool. That There's no way that's right because I... I remember it was the last day of school last year, which was May 26th. I uploaded my first video. So maybe I, I don't know. Maybe there's something that went wrong in the dating system. I don't know, but that's not right. I promise. I, I, the 26th is my one year anniversary. I promise. I'm already starting on lag, which is an issue. Lag's going to kill us. 20 bucks. Oh, now I have my better internet. It's not that much better, but it's the, the company I have it under is a lot more reliable. So... I've only ha I've had a few issues recently just because of uh, uh, upload speed. I didn't know that certain things were uploading by accident, so that's my honestly, fault. Pretty crazy because like this has twenty six views, and I I'd never get that. I I really I really can't tell you when's the last time I've gotten twenty six views on a video. The closest thing I'm 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 at like to that is the sniping of every Black Ops game, but that was a pretty well wellly made video. <laughs> Dude, this is just 
this is weird because watching this, it's like it makes me think of like I know this isn't this isn't the summer after Black Ops Three came out, but it's still it's like just chilling with a friend playing zombies at probably nighttime, just depending just off of my voice. I'm assuming it's nighttime. I'm hoping at least, but it, it's crazy to think. It's like I don't have this anymore. Like I don't play zombies, and I now that it's summertime, I have a lot more like time to play zombies or play Grand Theft Auto or play games that I I wouldn't really like. It wasn't necessary to fit in my schedule during the school year, but now that I have all this time, I could play these games that I usually don't play. Oh Something? shit! Something? A Panzer. It's a Panzer. Oh. I'm literally oh. distorting oh. my mic. Oh. I almost oh. die right here. How are we doing this? Sound warning. Oh fuck. Everybody, sound warning, you saw it. Oh, <laughs> so great! Wow. <laughs> that was the end of that. That was not that as bad. That was absolutely was so bad. That was not even relatively close to how bad I thought that was going to be. So that's my first ever video since I came back. Always doing better than Shane, what's new? Now, we are going to be watching the top 5 guns in Call of Duty Zombies. I'm probably going to watch this one all the way through because it is only 5 minutes, which, I mean, that's pretty good. So we're just going to watch this one all the way through. What's going on, guys? Welcome to my first top 5 video. The old and intro today again. Today is going to be the top 5 guns in Call of Duty Zombies. Something that's weird right off the bat is ever since World War II, like, I, <laughs> I saw this PPSH, I'm like, dude, it's so weird because I'm, I'm so used to the World War II one. Because I played so much on multiplayer, so I thought that was super weird, but it was completely normal back then. Zombies, so I hope you enjoy. At the number five spot, we have the M27 from Black Ops 2. Uh, the M27 can only be obtained in Nuketown, which I mean, it kind of sucks because I mean, using this on Buried would be kind of fun. Because Buried I agree. Really I, I agree. That. I agree. Um, M27 is in my top five favorite guns of all time. Just Still is. I just, I don't know. I love it. I just love everything about it. I love it. it. I uh, love the package name's a Mystifier, which sounds absolutely Mystifier. beautiful. The rate of fires, I mean, it's pretty good. Um, then when you pack up, well, it starts with uh, <laughs> in 40 bullets, and then, I mean, like, you have your 30 in your clip, and then when you pack a punch it. So the only reason why uh, this is slowed down is because... I didn't get long enough gameplays, and I, I set a standard for myself in my later top fives that I have to get a five minute gameplay of the gun of me like straight killing. So if it's in the between rounds, I think I included that too in the five minutes. But I had to get a five minute gameplay because I knew I wouldn't talk about a gun for five minutes because I had issues like this where I got too short of gameplays and then I'd have to slow it down and just play it. Three hundred and sixty. And then you have quite a bit of mobile. Also, I would literally go to the website. I go to the COD wiki and I I'd read the stats off of the sheet. I'd be like, it has a uh, two thousand and uh, sixteen damage, which I mean that's not it, but like I just read it right off the thing and be like, the pack punch version has a uh, four thousand and twenty five damage. It's it's so weird because I probably wouldn't have done that. Now I just say it's super powerful. It kills zombies in like a one to two shot or whatever it is. So just for an example, ability. Uh, since it's an AR, and then when you pack a punch, you get higher damage and more ammo. This this weapon's honestly the best of both worlds, and the best of both worlds. Like, what's the other world? Like, that's my question. I'm just so I'm so much better with words, and even if I do mess up, like I did a little bit earlier with a Cree, I like I make fun of myself. If you're like a Cree, I meant agree. Like I I may I correct myself and I make it sort of like not really a joke because you guys aren't laughing, but I, I make it sort of funny. That that's the number five spot. At the number four spot, we have the Dracon from Black Ops Three. Mm. Now the sniper is available at all or in all Black Ops at Three all. maps, and you'd think, oh yeah, snipers have never been that good in zombies. Well, Black Ops Three, all the snipers were good in zombies. Um, when you pack a punch it, it becomes the Bahamut, I think. Uh, the ammo complete it increases a lot. Um, the Bahamut. Max ammo. Well, I not the ammo. Well, yeah, the the ammo does increase, but the damage increases a lot. Uh, and then when you the extras that you get when you pack so I, I referenced this earlier about like m Mistaking my words. I would usually now I just like stop talking and I would just redo it from the start Or I would kind of put it in cuts So I would like say something about the damage and then stop talking and then say something about the range Stop talking say something about the recoil stop talking So then if I do mess up then I just have to go back to oh, I messed up the recoil part Okay, I'll just start back up when I was talking about the recoil. So Again, I wasn't too good with my words back then, but now I, I have a I'm very uh, very sly with my words
pack a punch you get the higher damage more reserve ammo and you also get the full metal jacket so that's the number four spot at the number three honestly. spot we have the commando from black ops one zombies <laughs> uh, another commando i remember getting this game getting this gameplay was the hardest thing ever dude i remember trying to get this it was terrible it can be found in any black ops one zombies map i believe um it's uh pack a punch name is the predator the damage that comes with it is pretty i mean it's it's breathtaking i don't know if it's breathtaking but it's amazing like it this gun's actually amazing um i'd like to point out that this gameplay took me forever to find and get along with the number one spot i didn't even get the gameplay for the number one spot but you'll see what about happens that. once we get there but this gun's absolutely amazing you have great mobility the rate of fire is pretty good i love the overall look of the gun and this one is again gonna is in my top five favorite guns in call of duty zombies so that's our number three spot at the number two spot on this list we have the galil from black ops one black ops two and uh black ops three um, who would have thought all the black ops the Galil uh, Has amazing damage. It's always been a personal favorite of mine It isn't in my top five favorite guns like the rest of the, these from the list But it is I mean, it's always been like close to me We'd always call it like the Gal or what was it? We always called it a weird name. Nobody really knows how to say it right and then um, Yeah, the, the max ammo it's is around Galeo. 300. It's the Galil map uh, for the unpack a punch and the pack a punch is 490 the, their stats are about equal for Black Ops That's 1 my and grandma. Black Ops 2. I remember that. automatic gun, and it's an amazing gun that kills, as you can see in this gameplay. So that's our number two spot. Guys, what other gun could be at the number one spot? Clearly, I don't know. The I best don't know. gun in Call of Duty Zombies history has to be the PPSH. Sorry, I just hit my mic there. The PPSH was introduced in World at War in... Also, it is in Black Ops 3. The Black Ops 3 version is not as good as the World at War one. But the um, you guys might be asking, why do I have a Tommy Gun gameplay? Because, like I said in my Commando, when I was talking about the Commando, I said, oh, I had troubles with the number one spot. Every Look at this I shit. Look at this shit. Get this gameplay, just because... I one shot with I jug so with jug one, i got one, one, one shot war. with and jug war, it's just, i don't know why it's just such like a challenge for me and i and when i got the pbas the ppsh once but i just i died with it the next round and that made, you're probably thinking like why is it number one on your list that no it was my fault because i was freaking sitting on my phone thinking that or i like thought i had it paused because i didn't have my astros on my head and I just died, and I was so mad, and I just couldn't get a gameplay, so yeah. It, I'm, I remember this, it, no joke, took me around three hours just to, like, finally give up. I was like, I think this is the final straw, I'm like, this is great proof to show that I, I can't get it, it's not in my favor. But yeah, here's a Tommy Gun gameplay, and the reason why I do not have this PPSH gameplay, and I just said, screw it, I'm not looking for it. It's because of basically clips like this where I, I die from stupid ass reasons. Like I get one shot after getting caught on a curb with Jug. So that's annoying. Okay, now back to the PVSH. The PVSH has Okay, we know a, what the PVSH like, does. A crazy rate of fire. And an end crazy amount of fire. I like it. What's going on guys? Uh welcome to an episode of Grand Theft. Auto <laughs> that's my Fire. guy. What's wrong with him? <clears throat> What's going on, guys? Welcome to uh, another Grand Theft Auto video. Uh, I sure hope your your day is as good as mine is. Um, I'm not, I mean, personally, my day isn't too good, but I just want to make sure you guys are having a very fine day. And it's a sunny day in Ohio, and uh, yeah, so have a have a good day, guys. Enjoy my video and uh, press the like button and subscribe if you're new. That's all I got. See you later. No, this is when I even. This is when I talk like. I don't talk to Shane anymore. Like I don't talk to him in school. It, it first started with me like talking to him every day on Discord. Then it turned into me talking to him only on in school, and I don't like talk to him in school anymore. I mean, yeah, it is. Granted, it is the first day of summer, which that's that's pretty fucking lit. But still, like even when we had like the final few months of school, we just didn't talk. We didn't even like look at each other. It, it, we don't even. Look, we like cut our streak off on snapchat that's how you know it's real bro all right might as well like that shit up i can't even watch my own videos i'm pretty sure this is my first ever cut com and it's my first ever face reveal so let's see how i am i'll move my my face out of the way if it contradicts with how it is what's going on homies welcome it to does, my first so. mwr video and today i have webcam for the 
first time so you know i want you guys i just tried pausing what the heck okay so let's let's start off one i like Okay, one, I show like so much. <laughs> I, I, I know it's not like a super bad thing, but I show a lot more of my desk because I have my camera like right between my two monitors because I had no option. I actually had a Canon camera, but it only recorded 720p. So now I have the Logitech C920, whatever it is. And my mic is over to the, would it be to the left of me in this video, but it's, or into the video that we're watching, but the right of me. Uh, right now, which I think is pretty cool. I have this little billboard and it's under my desk right now because in the middle of the night It would scare the living shit out of me because I just wake up to a loud bang because it would fall off the wall, which is I mean It, it wasn't very small. So I just kind of got rid of it I'm still wearing the bracelet that I'm wearing in that video. I would never take it off I so I'm I haven't changed that much, but I do look a little bit older and um, a lot more mature not really, I look like the same exact person. Just to enjoy this time, I think I'm gonna... Wait. What's going on, homies? Well, okay, so I do have the new intro MWR as well. And I have a lot of energy as well. For the first time, so you know, I want you guys to enjoy this time. I think I'm gonna implement what you this time we have together. Videos, just because I feel like if I'm being very silent, which I have a tendency to do when I'm playing Overwatch or probably Call of Duty, then my face can do the talking. You'll be like, oh yeah, he's focusing. Because I have a very distinct focus face. Yeah, it's like, so this is going to be cut comp that's what style. It looks like. So it's going to be split to when I'm talking. It's not going to be like, there's hopefully not going to be any like random silences unless I'm focusing. And I'll show you like if there's like a clip that I'm hitting, then you'll see when I'm focusing. So I was playing Call of Duty Black Ops 3 with Cade. And Caden made the suggestion okay. of downloading this game again. I was like, why not? I haven't played this game forever. Uh, might as well download it again and see how it is. So I downloaded it, and I'm very happy I downloaded it. I feel like let's see how it is. So let's let's why not? stop for a second. Let's stop for a second, Chief. Uh, might as well. My focus face now, and I'm pretty sure you could see it in here, but my focus face is like, like I put my tongue like on my cheek or something like that. But right now I'm just like in this, this part. I'm a little bit calm. I'm just like turn, shoot, shoot, shoot. I downloaded it and I'm very happy I downloaded it. I feel like there's a lot of good things about this. I downloaded it and I'm very happy I downloaded it. I feel I just cut myself off in the editing. Oh my god. I feel like there's a lot of good things about this game that I, I really did miss. And there, I mean, th with good things, there are bad things, and this game does have bad things. Like for bad things, uh, I feel like airstrikes literally shake your stream like if you're having a seizure. And it's Call of Duty annoying. fucking so World War II. I feel like that's something that they should fix. And it's not necessarily something they can fix because it's not an issue. But I feel like it's just something that's super annoying. A lot of people should get nerfed. Well. Another problem with this game is that they have Jug. And that it was in the original game. But I just feel like it's just something that's just so hard to counter against like if i'm sniping i and they have jug i'm not gonna get the kill i mean unless i hit both of my shots like a guy with a shotgun and jug i feel like that's a little bit overkill there are a lot of i feel like with the i was i remember i was so proud of myself when i edited that i was just like do you kid it look at this look at this little edit right here dude look at the cool this is but like i just just zoomed in the camera the addition of this game being remastered and there's like new kids playing it it's a very douchey game or there's a whole bunch of doucheyish people playing it now and i guess i'm laying down and now i'm getting killed so uh i can i can't speak too much but on overgrown for instance you have people that have their eyeballs surgically freaking attached to their scope i probably would have said fucking which is bad attached to the ground and i'm just like why that's how can you have fun just sitting in the back end of the i don't look at the screen? camera that's like, so I weird can't, i can't snipe Unless I I'm just I'm in this video. I'm literally just talking to the screen like I'm just looking at it, it's just like This is like imagine me doing like this dude. I'm literally talking to the screen like I don't understand anything I I don't know. It's really weird. I'm just I'm not talking to anybody I'm just talking to the screen not to like you guys Like I can't hard scope and snipe. I have to I cannot like basically do this I can maybe yeah, do, I still like, can't do that. like searching and then like flick and then do that. I just can't like Keep aiming in while firing. Like, mm, got it. Mm, like, mm. oh, that would have been my clat. I need, a, I need a clat to get that one camo. Like, there's a lot of things. I looked to the left of it, so I'm like, and mm. make it a little bit better. But again, they wanted to stick to the roots, and I can't. I mean, I'm happy they did because I LJB, a lot of Luke, leaky I juice box. Shout out to that man. That they stuck to their roots.
So I also have a lot of good things. Like I feel like this game looks absolutely beautiful. The graphics absolutely. are amazing. I feel like they did a good job with the guns. The gun sounds just everything about the guns. Shotguns are not super. My okay. posture is really the good. ARs, you Look at me right now. Good I'm to, like, to use them and SMGs, like the ones that you can literally like, just hit fire with and get kills. They're not as OP as like, for instance, the VMP or the vest. How did I do that? It does require skill in this game, but it doesn't require too much skill. Like you can literally pick up a controller and snipe. And that's what I really, really like about this game. Like I've wanted to get better at sniping and this is my game that I feel like I can get a lot better at sniping. It's kind of hard sniping a bog because again, you have people that are hanging in the back of the map and basically just like killing you right when you come off a of spawn. It's really, really annoying because I'm trying to do quick scoping and the rest are like head glitching inside the bus or head glitching in the back of the map or for instance pushing this side. Like, oh my god, if I could. S oh, I'm garbage. Oh, I did the tongue thing right there. Me, but it's whatever. Look at the tongue thing. Look See, at the that guy thing. just tried drop shotting me. That's just the people that play it ruined this game. It's like, still I, like that. It it's still, really still like that. Game is still I, I still feel that way because it, it's getting like that on the older Call of Duty. See, the older Call of Duty never used to be like that. Maybe like two years ago, but like ever since they started playing Black Ops Two, like recently, there's been a lot more people camping, and it's annoying. Like Call of Duty Ghosts wouldn't be too bad, but it's all campers, so you can't do anything about that. Really, really fun to play. But for instance, I don't think IW is such a terrible game. I just feel like I still feel the way that way. It. You have people that are sweating their anuses off the whole entire goddamn time, and then again, jug. Like that's just—it's just something that's annoying to to play against. Okay, I'm like, dude, they're just kind of camping back there. What are they doing? Again, people ruin this. Like they—that's people You're getting ruin angry. these games. Like people in Call of Duty, the only bad thing about black ops 3 that i would say is people using the brecci and that's because again people doing things that are ruining the game oh shit i got one kill <gasps> mm -mm. oh choked the one shot got another shot see that guy he's just chilling in the corner it's like bro you gotta like why are you scared to push them like i feel like I play Overwatch and Call of Duty like all the time, and when I talk, when I hear anybody talking in game chat, ninety five percent of the time it's a like a eleven year old, twelve year old, and it's kind of annoying because they're. I feel like I don't know why they like think camping is so fun. Like I have to rush in the middle with a sniper. Like I can't. I'm still that way. I'm. I've always been a run and gun. I've always been like a sub player, and I told myself at the beginning of World War Two, I was gonna be an AR player, or I think it was the other way around, and. No, I, mean, I think I said I was going to be an AR player, and then I was, I turned into like a sub player because I don't like sitting back. It's not really that fun for me. I don't, I like running and gunning. I like rushing mid. I like rushing objectives. So I don't know how people are sh like so entitled to one position that like sitting behind a car the whole entire game. I don't know how people do that or sitting in a corner because that's just, that's not fun. Like how I play Call of Duty to have fun, which is getting kills. Getting kills is fun. Doing good is fun. But when you're trying to do good and you're getting shut down by people that are having fun by sitting in a corner i mean i don't know how you really counter that and sit back and snipe like that's just not how i play and i guess you got to think about positioning i guess is one thing that you that's not positioning when you're playing this game you got to think about where could the enemies be when i jump through this window like they're gonna be on the left here Fuck. Not. i'll pick up this mp5 though I'm also very happy that wall banging is back in this game because you know in Black Ops 3 it's non-existent at all. You could literally still isn't. through a piece of paper and you would be able to not get the kill. You'd be able to not get the kill. Look at him. See, Look at this guy. Camping in a corner. Like how do you have fun like that? Like I'm really like I'm really confused upon that. I laid down on the guy's body. That's pretty lit. Oh. No ammo. Am I still alive? I feel like the MP5 is one of the most easiest guns to use in this game. The most easiest. It just be it. It just be easiest. For so in conclusion, I really really like this game, but again, like every game, it has its bad things. Like you have somebody that lays down when he gets slightly hurt, and I still kill him, and they're gonna shoot me. But I'm basically the doing the same thing right there. I'm just not laying down. I'm just hiding behind cover. Oh, I hate when people do dude, that. I lit him up. When it comes to when it comes to Call of Duty, it seems to be like the people kind of ruin the game. It feels like. 
uh, when I play IW, the people basically ruin the whole game for me. They are the ones that are jump shotting, drop shotting, even though I'm jump shotting and drop shotting. But like I said, it's just the people that ruin them. And last stand isn't even like a problem in this game. Like I barely see any people running last stand. Oh, you never do, it's honestly. It's kind of super rare for me to see last stand in this game. I don't know why, but it is. Like, look at that guy. He just laid down. He threw a nade and laid down. Like, how do people do that? Just like, sitting by a crate. Like, what's wrong with him? Do that and can't He's do just that. sitting there. So how do you have patience? Really this game, but along with every game in the world, there are some things that they could do to change it. So, I really love this game. I'd probably give it a 7.5 out of 10. It's a I was really reviewing a game, 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 game that was like... I kind of, I guess, I just have to give eh, my... Yeah, like six, nice seven game. months old. So, thank you guys for being with me for a year. You know, it's not a lot of you, it's around two, but that's fine. I have 64 subscribers. I think I've grown around maybe 50 in the past year, and then I've gotten around uh, 2,500 views, somewhere around there, 2,400 views in the last year, which, I mean, it's not what I expected, but, I mean, life isn't really, you can't, ex like, predict life, which I'm, I'm still having fun with it. That's the insane part. Yeah, sure, I'm not getting a lot of success, but I'm still having a lot of fun with what I'm doing. So I'm going to keep doing this for as long as I can, as long as I want, and as long as I'm having fun with it. So if you enjoyed this video, press the like button, subscribe if you're new, and that's all I got. See ya. That's all, folks.